But me being me, the next morning I got up, I was already, I was ready for the next, on the next one. one. I'd already put it behind me and was hit, moving on for the next one. So uh, you got it back to back first in the Arnold Classic. Let's talk about that a little bit. Yeah. So um, people always ask me what my best condition was, and uh, I always have two answers. I think the 2009 Olympia, mm-hmm. I got second. Um, you know, Jay, actually, I beat Mr. Olympia. Dexter was Mr. Olympia. Yeah. Uh, I beat him. He got third, and then Jay came back after being defeated and came in his all time lightest body weight. Yeah. But his all time best condition. Best condition. Uh, um, you know, he, he got the nod over me uh, yeah. and won the show. And then uh, I think that and the 2011 Arnold Classic that I won were uh-huh. my two best you know, conditions. I think they were both about equal. Yeah. Um, you know, uh, <clears throat> that was one of those goals I set for myself when I was 18 years old. I said I'm going to win the Arnold Classic. And um, no you know, so that was a, that was a huge, cool. uh, huge deal for me. Yeah. Um, and um, I remember um, – at that show, it was probably uh, one of the best, biggest honors I've ever been paid. Mm-hmm. So um, they did the call out. They called me, Dennis Wolf. You know, um, I think Dexter. Um, I think Evan was up in that call. Sent the body. Yeah, yeah, Victor or something. We did our uh, comparisons. They told me to step off. And um, that means you might have won. That means you just knocked it out of the park. That means you might have won. It's a, it's a grand slam. That's all. And that feeling, yeah. Branch. That's. And, uh, I remember I walked backstage. I stepped off the stage, and I'm like. And Arnold was standing right there, and I was like, I just wanted to jump up and down and scream, you know, because I'm just like, you just can't understand. When you worked for something for so long, for so for years, yeah, for, and ever since you were a little a kid, yeah, you're like, this is what you you were training and for. You did it, and um, you know, and I'm just like, I just I knew, and um, so then um, they're getting ready. We're back there, and here come and Trish is back there, and she could pee the night before, mm-hmm. but security's really tight, and mm-hmm. I think back then Arnold was still governor. Mm-hmm. And, um, the governor. Yeah, so he has all of his security and stuff. So <laughs> security, you couldn't, you, you couldn't get backstage, right? Right. Unless you were a competitor, or you had a. You know, pass. And that place is packed, anyways. Yeah, it's like a so, can uh, of sardines. And so I see her back there, and I'm like, and she's just smiling. I'm like, I'm like, how'd you get back here? And and she wouldn't. I'm like, I knew, I, I just knew because somebody went and got somebody her. Somebody got her and, and brought her back there. And, and then I mean, Arnold came up to her and he, he goes, "Oh, you're Branch's wife," and blah blah blah. And I'm just like, this is gonna be a good night. Hell and, uh, yeah. So, um, I, you know, I got to, I won the show and, um, you know, um, I went out, we had a party that night and, uh, had a great time, mm-hmm. ate some cheeseburgers, had a couple of cheeseburgers, all my, all, all the people in my life, except from my mom, she wasn't there, but mm-hmm. everybody that was pretty much everybody important to me at that time yeah. was there. That's cool. And, uh, so we, it was a, it was a really good feeling. And, um, but me being me the next morning I got up, I was already, I was ready for the next, on the next one. one. I'd already put it behind me and was hit, moving on for the next one. So, uh. 